Like many of you, I like to get mystical every now and again. I recently spent some time with musician Eleanor Friedberger at the Way Station Bar in Brooklyn having a psychic reading. Well, our futures look bright, ladies and gentlemen. Right, terrific. Well, we're about to do a reading with Stacy Wolf. Stacy, thanks for being here. We're going to find out a lot about ourselves. I'm excited. I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, I've never had my, my cards read. I've been around it and I've been uh, spooked out enough by it that I didn't want to get any closer because I'm always worried that you're going to have a jester that's on fire or something like that or, or some kind of uh, bleeding queen of, of the sea. And you'd say, well, what does that mean to me? And they'd say, well, it means you got about a month to live and uh, your aquarium's gonna spring a leak. And that always makes me, I just, I don't care for hearing that kind of bad news because uh, I, have you ever had tropical fish? It's expensive. Okay, so what's tropical fish? Is there a teal suited fella in there? <laughs> she nailed you. You think so? Be slick, be smooth. Stop trying your best and become more strategic. And you got next album's coming out soon. The next album's coming out in June. We're looking forward to it based on what Stacy said. It's like being birthed again and coming out for a second time, and it's magic. Really? It's really nice. I felt you saying yes, yes, even if you didn't articulate it, I felt it. Big. I was saying yes, yes. Yeah. <laughs> You're awesome because you've created a flow, you've created your career, you've created a flow. There's a word yeah. that, that was used a lot in our, in our experience with Stacy. One word. Yes. You created a path, you created your flow, and it, it flows. It's e so easy for you to keep this flow. Oh, this, this foundation is awesome, where's the flow? How do you stay on the fringe, but yet get in the flow, and get in the center of the flow? There's a real, you want it to keep flowing like that. Sounds yeah. promising. Talking about all this flow, I gotta hit the can, so. Seriously? <laughs> when I met Eleanor, uh, she reminded me, of course, uh, just in that her name is Eleanor, uh, of my great aunt Eleanor. And uh, she was a, a fine lady, but she didn't have any teeth. So when you would uh, say hello to her, she, she would often be doing that a lot. But this Eleanor was different, wasn't she? Full of vigor and spirit. Okay, <laughs> now I'm ready. Okay. Do, you want, do you want me to be here for this? Absolutely, okay. I don't want you to go anywhere. Okay. I sat through yours. <laughs> What'd they say about me? to be at the Oscars. <laughs> People love you. That's nice. It's, tr true. <laughs> it's true. So I feel like you need a bigger platform, and I feel like you, I mean, obviously you're creating your bigger platform right now. Just this table, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, I tell you, she hit it straight on, didn't she? Whoever she was talking to in her, in her dream state, in her trance, uh, they were certainly giving her some right information about this old fella. Uh, she was uh, telling me how popular I am, how many people love me, how successful I'm going to be, all good things, and I was not expecting to hear any of them. Usually I hear those kind of voices after a couple of drinks. <laughs> oh, God, this is nice to hear it from another person who's not me. All right, well, thank you, Eleanor. This My pleasure, thank terrific. you. Terrific, and uh, I certainly learned a lot about the future. <laughs> me too, maybe too much. <laughs> maybe, but I hope to see you again in the future. That'd be fun. We we'll get fun. together. All right. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Bye. Take care. Bye. If we were the spirits communicating, maybe some, some poses that we might take on our way to Stacy's house 
Like, what is our psychic form? Maybe I would uh -huh. just be dressed like me, but it may be a lot of sequins. It might be gold sequins, mm -hmm. pants, and maybe a jumpsuit of gold sequins. And I'd just come at you like this. The, the, the spiritual form would look like this. And then my voice would kind of be like, hey, there's some great things for you in the future. And just like, check it out in June. Probably like that. That's what you would look like if look, we met look. up again to go see Stacy. No, 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 no. <laughs> That's not what. I mean, if I was a spirit, oh, if I okay. took a spirit form, and you were coming with me, because now we're going to do I a lot of a stuff pony. together. I would be a pony. I would be a pony. Yeah. That was brown in color. Yeah. And had long, like a extra long, long mane. mane. Extra long, like sweeping on the floor, mane. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Like a Shetland. Not exactly. More a little. But An Arabian. Maybe, yeah. Yeah. And I'd be alongside you. But I'd, I would be whisper. I'd whisper. You'd, that would be your technique. Yeah. That's probably less creepy than the high voice. <laughs> <laughs> now that I think about it.